Daniston has changed you a lot, uncle. It must be exhausting to carry such a burden on you. To feel the endless pain and endure the nightmares of such chaos you have survived. But you, just like the others, only wanted to have your life this soon. Please don't look at me as I am some monster. I think I'm not different from you at all. Please tell me, uncle. Do you accept the rules of the island? Which price are you willing to pay to find your happiness? Do you want to make a new raid on the burial grounds? It's impossible right now. The war will soon rage on the island. The Stoviki are fucking up with the brigade, and nobody is going to support us anymore. There is no Soviet army left. We're on our own now. Our only chance is to gather the remnants of Vimpel anew. Listen, Reaper. Far from every one of ours is dead. It's a suicide mission, and to complete it, we need our mates. Yeah, they probably won't like it, but we have to find them anyway. You just don't understand me and the island. You look at me, you look at the other children of the island as we are your enemies. But we all, we, we all are just, just afraid of each other. other. That's why we feel so bad. That's why we feel so lonely. The island has given us a chance to build a new and wonderful life. Who are you? Identify yourself. We are here to send you regards to Varus The chemical weapon has already been sent to the burial ground. The thing you do is just worthless now. <laughs> ah, you bloody traitors! Recently, we have announced our new game, Pioneer. Now is the time to tell you more about it. In this video, we will talk about one of the key features of the game, combat system and character controls. We would like to mention that the game is still in development and some aspects are subject to change. Let's start with character movement and controls. We have decided to stray away from slow and clunky movement, often used in other more traditional survival games, and found a comfortable middle ground between arcade and simulator controls. So, if you're coming from any familiar shooter game, you will have an easy time to adapt without losing any scope for action. You can successfully employ various tactics and combat roles. The same concept goes for other parts of our game, from inventory management to weapon usage. We want our players to have many possibilities without overcomplicating the gameplay mechanics. Speaking of items, and especially weapons, there is plenty to choose from. Almost every gun can be modified in different ways, and some can even be crafted from local scrap and wreckage. Various modifications affect special stats, magazine size, accuracy, fire rate, the stuff you have seen hundreds of times. However, we have something special for you. In the world of Pioneer, your main enemy is the island and the threats spawned by it. So there has got to be a way to fight them and convenient firearms are not always enough. For special critical cases, there are special weapon modifications called artifacts. The artifacts are the sources of energy in Pioneer World. Energy erupted by anomalies or by the burial grounds. This energy is both a resource and a weapon. With the help of artifacts power, it is possible to create energy and incendiary ammo. Energy ammo is almost useless against the regular humans, but very effective against the monsters spawned by the anomalies and idiots clad in metal armor. Let me tell you how it works here. First of all, everyone in your squad is dead. You are alone now. The island is isolated by an anomaly. Secondly, brutal gangsters, tough guys like you and me are to hell right now. 
Do you understand the deal? I need the people who are ready to do the toughest things. Crazy sort of men like me and you. And you now are just my borrower. So, my dear comrade, are you ready to pay your debt? The storm has gone, and skies have returned to the regular colors. But the handless storm that took her island into blockade still remains. Yes! The storm doesn't disappear to this day. As survivors, we have somehow adjusted to new ways. We have rebuilt fortifications, shelters. We continue to explore the islands and still look for solutions and reasons. But there is always a lot of destruction and hatred among us. The island is inhabited by all sorts of scum. It's to be case of local freaks out of tribes. Brigadiers are like former Soviet deserters. There are also sorts of morning fanatics, kinds of gangs, abnormal creatures, mutated animals, and some real 